5. Kotulun, a noble wrestler. She was Genghis Khan's great-great-granddaughter. Her father taught Kotulun about the inner workings of the military. She issued a challenge for her marriage. Any man who could defeat her in a wrestling match would win her heart. Any man she defeated had to give her a horse in exchange. She eventually acquired 10,000 horses. 4. Rani Lakshmi Bey, the fiery queen of Jhansi. She was called the most dangerous of all Indian leaders. One of the greatest heroes of the first war for Indian independence was Rani Lakshmi Bey. She was the rebel leader that overthrew the British in India. The Jhansi state was to be annexed by the British authorities. This choice infuriated Queen Lakshmi Bey. She battled on the front lines while carrying her son on her back. She persisted in fighting until the British soldiers severely wounded her. The British were forbidden from touching the Queen's body. So she requested to be burned by a hermit. Locals cremated her after her demise. 3. Jean de Clisson, the Lioness of Brittany. To avenge the beheading of her husband, she sought out French ships. Because of the English and French proxy wars, her husband was put to rest forever. Jean was horrified and furious. She vowed retaliation. She assembled a force of devoted soldiers, sold her estate, and purchased three warships. Warships had crimson sails and black hulls. My revenge was the name of the flagship. The English Channel was being patrolled by the black ship fleet. They attacked French ships and massacred the crew. Only a small group of men were remained who could inform the French king. Each French nobleman captured on the seized ships was beheaded by Jean herself. She was given the moniker the Lioness of Brittany as a result. Her revenge in the English Channel continued for 13 years. 2. Nancy Wake, the White Mouse. She was a resistance leader, saboteur, and special agent during World War II. She made it through four days of Gestapo questioning. A 5 million franc bounty was placed on her head by the Gestapo. Their most wanted list included Nancy. Over 200 downed Allied pilots were saved by her. She detonated a few German supply stockpiles. Nancy used her bare hands to finish an SS stormtrooper so that he wouldn't sound the alarm. She received multiple awards for her wartime contributions. Her honors included the George Medal, the Croix de Guerre with Palm, twice, the Croix de Guerre with Star, the Médaille de la Résistance, and the U.S. Medal of Freedom with Bronze Palm. 1. Ludmila Pavlichenko, Lady Death. She was the most successful female sniper in history. Due to her gender, she was first turned down for military service. The 25th Chapayev Rifle Division of the Red Army ultimately accepted her. Ludmila quickly gained a reputation as a formidable sniper. During World War II, she was credited with 309 verified finishes. Even so, the Germans spoke to her over a megaphone. If she defected and joined her side, they offered her consolation and chocolates. The Germans called her Lady Death because of her terrible talent.